San Francisco. Uh, I'm so happy to be here today with my wife and my kid. Um, and so happy to be here with all of you. It's my great privilege to introduce the board of directors for the AIDS Talk San Francisco Foundation. It's incredibly humbling to be charged with leading this group of eight directors that serves as a stewards for this this great San Francisco event and tradition. There are other AIDS walks in other cities, but San Francisco's is as special as our city itself. Um, here, people don't, uh, where people don't express their political, who, people who don't express their beliefs are the minority. And here, where AIDS was first treated as the emergency, as an emergency, when so many other cities chose to bury their heads in the sand. This board understands that history and each board member is part of that history. That's why on your behalf, as guardians of the funds you have raised, and out of commitment to see those dollars put to use in service of the greatest possible goods, we selected Project Open Hand, Positive Resource Center, and Ward 86 Golden Compass Program as lead beneficiaries this year. And we could not be more, than hap more happy with that decision. So it's my pleasure to introduce the board members today, all of whom are here with you, walking with you, rallying with you, volunteering, and fundraising with you. So they are Robert Mansfield, treasurer. Frank DeRosa. Susanna Dunlap. Bryce Kumagai. Richie McAllister. Isaac Rodriguez and Linda Wallabango. I speak for all the directors when I say thank you.